I'm Steve Bellion and you've joined me today at Tunnel Barn Farm and I'm going to give you a little bit of a chat about uh, my absolute go-to favourite ground bait and that's the Sweet Marine by Mainline Match. This stuff absolutely stinks, it's packed full of natural attractants and I think when you get it on your hands and you see it in the bait tub and give it a little bit of a whiff you'll see why the fish absolutely love it. And there's a general misconception um, up amongst people that are new into the fishing world that ground bait really is just for the feeders, for the methods, for the cages, for the rivers, but it's not. It can be an absolutely devastating tactic to use down the edges and out in front of you on commercials like this at Tunnel Barn Farm and ultimately this stuff will get you more fish in your net. Why do I like to use Sweet Marine? Well, it's absolutely packed full of natural attractants. It really reeks, it's dark in colour, so it doesn't spook those wary fish down the edges or out in front of you as well. Uh, also, it's a really versatile ground bait. You can fish anything pretty much over the top of it, whether you're fishing a big bunch of maggots targeting carp on, on, on big lakes or snake lakes, or if you're targeting F1s as well, or silvers, it works just as well. So I'm going to show you the different consistencies that I'll mix it to and how I personally like to fish it. Okay, so the way that I like to mix it, I get a liberal dose out of the bag, I pour it into a mixing bowl, and what I do, I add water until I get to the consistency where I can squeeze it between my hands. And then what I like to do, just give it a quick run through of my hand and then push it through a little riddle to get out of any of the lumpy pieces, push them through as well. And then I'll leave that for about 10 to 20 minutes just to absorb all of that water. One of my favourite ways of introducing this ground bait into the peg is through a little pot on the end of my pole, just tapping out nuggets at a time uh, with a double maggot or a bunch of maggots if I'm targeting carp as a hook bait. It's absolutely devastating. 